Hi all, welcome back to our channel. In this video, it gives an idea about product comparison tools and wish list in Odoo 15 website model. A customer can choose a product by comparing its level with a product comparison tool. This tool assists the buyers in selecting commodities based on attribute, color, warranty, price, etc. You can also replace one product with another on an e-commerce website. So the user must activate the product comparison tool from Odoo 15 website module. So we can click on the settings menu below the configuration tab and enable the product comparison tool option inside the product section. By activating the product comparison tool, we can allow the shoppers to differentiate the commodities as per attribute. So you can choose the save icon after enabling this specific field. Now let's view what happens when a customer visits your website. So we can click on this go to website option and then choose the shop menu here. So the user can view the compare icon inside each product in your website shop. So after clicking on this compare icon, the product is placed inside the compare menu. So we can add multiple product to the comparison menu. So here two product customizable desk and warranty are added to the compare menu. So the user can remove the compared product by choosing this delete option. And then you can evaluate the product separately by clicking on the compare option inside the compare menu. And a new page opens before you. So the product page opens before you after selecting the compare button. Then we can access a detailed description of commodities on the compare product page. So the buyers can add a product to the cart by selecting the add to cart in the compare products window. And putting multiple product into a cart from the compare product page is also easy. So the user can compare the general features and warranty of commodities by enabling the product comparison tools feature. Now let's go through the activation of wishlist feature in Odoo 15 website. A shopper can secure the product collection needed to buy and save them in a user account for future reference, known as the wishlist. So it shows a customer interest in a specific raw material. So the customer can buy the wishlist product later as per their desires. So a company can manage the wishlist feature on the website using Odoo 15 website module support. So the user need to activate the wishlist option on the settings window of Odoo website. So here we can see the option wishlist. So here I'm already enabled the feature. So by activating this uh, wishlist option, the shopper can save product in your website wishlist feature. We can click on the save button to activate the wishlist feature on Odoo website. Now we can move to the website and see how it works. For that, we can choose the e-commerce dashboard menu in the dashboard tab and click on this go to website in your company website. Here we can select this shop menu on the website page and a list of all the products are visible here. So here the user can add to wishlist icon inside each product. So after selecting uh, the add to wishlist icon, a product is moved into the wishlist feature. So here we have added the product Kerbal management box to the wishlist and you can see one product in the wishlist option. So here the user can view the product Kerbal management box on the my wishlist screen after clicking on this wishlist option. 
So uh, here we can delete the product by choosing uh, the remove icon inside your product. And the user can send the product into the cart after choosing the add to cart button. And it is also possible to save a product in your wish list and add it to the cart by enabling the add product to my cart but keep it in my wish list field. Additionally, the user can compare the raw material by selecting the add to compare icon below this product. So we can apply more than one product to the wish list based on a specific user's interest. Hence, it is easy to save your product into a wish list using Odoo website. Now let's go through the analysis of online sales. A user can analyze the online sales progress on a website through the reporting features of Odoo 15. So we can choose the online sales menu below the reporting section and a new page opens to you. Here in this graph view, we can access the data regarding the order date on the X axis and the Y axis consists of the count. Then the user can apply different measures to graphical representation by choosing this measures icon. And it is easy to evaluate the online sales growth of a company on specific date. Then you can apply different filters group by and the favorite options available here in this window. And here in this pivot view of this online sales analysis window, a pivotal table consisting of a total sales order amount in a particular month is visible to you. Hence, we can quickly analyze the online sales growth of your company from the website module. So that's all about the video. Thank you for watching.